the added characters and stuff feels shoehorned in because as a uh, old school player of this game you're so used to it not being there that it's 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 you know it's a little jarring it's like whoa this this was so unnatural compared to how things flowed before but i think it's much more beneficial if you've never played this before because then it, it'll just feel right uh, I do recommend playing it with the Japanese text, uh, Japanese, uh, voice, though, because you will notice the difference in, um... You'll notice the difference in voice acting quality. And not just voice acting quality, like, the the audio quality is, like, not that good in some of the lines. You thought you could win? Too bad. Oh, my battery power is going. Prescriptions ready at Walmart's. Me getting that later. I will say one major thing is like the load times are kind of wonky too on the computer version, PC version. Uh, we're not quite done with that. Also, you notice me, like, not doing my full, like, regular normal attack Sorry, but you're going before I start throwing in arts, and that's because sometimes you get stuck in the old ways of only having three regular attacks. That's really lame that I was forced to bring the dog with me. I don't remember having to bring him last time. But that's because last time there's only seven party members total. Like, you never ever get any more. So, you always had, like, one team that had more or less people on it. So, I guess that's why, you know, they made Patty join you because they thought it was more difficult. I'm not sure what people think, you know, when they design games. Whoops, don't want to do that. Let's finish learning that. And you're fine. You're fine. Alright. I do have to remember that uh, axes have slower attack speed. Which is really annoying. Let's see, I could probably stop using this, now that I actually have other arcane arts to use. Like, it's weird, because I'm pretty sure axes weren't meant to be used that way. It's like, well, I'm gonna hit you with the blunt end of it. They're more for chopping things, you know? A lot of his attack animations don't really go with the choppy chop side of things. Get ready. I'm taking you down. Yeah, this dungeon's pretty straightforward, which is nice. It's not It's not overly long either. Fucking dog, stop attacking my targets, dude. You're ruining my I'm messing up my jams here. It's like you're breaking him out of the stun that he was in. Blowing up my spot. <laughs> there is a skill of his called Full Check that I apparently don't have. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to, uh... Learn all my weapon skills again. Let's eliminate Which, them. like I reiterate, you only have to do the 
the first time through, you don't really have to do it again. You thought you could win? Too bad. Yeah, see, like, the low times on the ship are, like, weird. Like, there's not much to say about this place, either. Like, make sure you kill enough of, the, like, the mermen and the ghosts and stuff so you can get spirit essences and stuff, because you're going to need that for synthesis. But other than that, it's just... Just a regular old dungeon. You have those spirit fragments. Done. Not much to say. Oh, I will say, well, when we get to it, I could talk about the fact that uh, this the, there's a boss on the ship. There wasn't a boss before, but they've added one. Don't get sloppy. Uh, he has a secret mission, like a PS3 version secret mission, so I will tell you more about it when the actual boss fights happen. Right, I don't have a... Don't have a, a guardian field. These are the threads that weave our future. Alright, Q. Yeah, and at this point, she doesn't have much in the way of a... Melee, so... Just leave her where she is. She's mostly just gonna spam full time over and over. Like, I really can't get into more advanced character spotlights and shit until we have the bulk of our abilities and skills. And even then, on your first playthrough, having an ideal setup isn't going to happen because uh, you simply don't have enough skill points to equip all the skills that you need. Let's go. But that's why for sure you want to grind. From my calculations that I did, for all the stuff that I wanted, I needed at least 9100 grade. So, you know, it might be more or less depending You'll on what you want. Enough. Like if you want everything and you only want to do new game plus one other time, then you're probably going to want to grind. Closer to like fifteen thousand grade. The sign of victory. But like these games, like grinding grade is somewhat efficient, but it gets more efficient, you know, with all the bells and whistles, like double grade. Um you know, depending on what difficulty you're playing it on, also doubles like if you're playing on unknown difficulty, that also doubles the amount of grade you earn in battle. So but you're going bye -bye. And you can only unlock unknown on New Game Plus, so... Yeah. You're realistically not going to get everything done your first time around. Right. They know each other way too but to make the game, you know, easier... Like, on my current New Game Plus, it's like two times experience with SP1... Um, carried over all my titles, carried over all my arts, because I didn't want to have to relearn them again. Um, I carried over the titles because uh, that's the whole point of doing the secret missions in one playthrough, is to get Yuri's uh, true knight costume, we true can't knight lose. title. But, like, doing it a second time, you don't really... Assuming you carry over titles, which is why I recommend at least grinding out the grade for that. 
But then you're not to worry about doing the second mission as well. Like, they do add a little bit of difficulty, but like... They're really not worth it outside of getting that title. Like, doing the second mission, I think, gets you like an extra 10 grade, so... Multiply that times 4 when you're playing on Unknown and times 2 grade, it's like an extra 40. But grade really isn't the issue when you're playing this game because you can grind it very easily. It's all a matter of just how you want to play the game in the end. Yeah, the boss fight for this is actually pretty cool. 